Hello and welcome back to another installment of Thursday Throwdown. I'm your sexy ranch and co-host Calder Ness. This is the show where we pit two Golden Age sets against each other and you vote for the figures on our teams. This week I am building out of the Lord of the Rings set and Simeon is building out of the Halo set. Playing some Halo clicks, some epic actions, some grenades. We're playing on Helm's Deep, Simeon won map roll. We will also be playing with the new rules articles uh, as they are right now. So that'll be uh, one through four, which is where we're at. So that's the changes to Leap Climb, RCE, CCE, pushing damage, theme teams. We both have theme teams this week. Very, you know, first, I think, since we've ever both had a theme team, or at least a very, very long time. So we it's both the very a theme first team. that we both had one, yeah. Okay, yeah, so first time we both have a theme team. Uh, I think both are named, not that that matters anymore. But yeah, so we're going to try our best to follow the new rules articles. This may give a grasp to see, you know, people can see it and play a little bit. Anyway, Simeon, why don't you go ahead and jump into your team? Yeah, this will definitely, I mean, it'll be the first time I'm doing it as well, so it'll be interesting to say the least. Up first um, is Master Chief. Surprise, surprise, he made it on the team. Uh, this is Fist of Rucked version the big old gravity hammer slammer thing that he has. Uh, he's got the United Nations Space Command team ability. In fact, everyone on my team has it because they're all UNSC soldiers. Um, those are my two themes, technically. He has one special power, and that is bring down the hammer. Master Chief can use charge and leap climb, and with the new leap climb, he could use it in tandem with charge, but this power continues to say, while using charge, he ignores other characters and terrain for movement perspective purposes except indoor blocking terrain which would essentially be better than the combo of leap climb and charge anyhow but uh going through those two powers would be compatible so that's cool um next up and that's literally all that's special about him but he's kind of cool uh next up is master chief needler so this is the spiky gun alien gun thing and this is my first master chief with the throw a grenade trait slash pool uh, ability. So I'll get into that, and then I'm only going to do it once, and then I'll explain what the grenades do as they pop up. So throw a grenade is give the character a power action, decrease the number of grenades in your grenade pool by one, if greater than zero, and choose a type of grenade listed on this card. Choose a target square within five squares and line of fire, ignoring characters for line of fire purposes. Make a ranged combat attack targeting all characters occupying or adjacent to the target square. Deal damage to each character hit based only on the type of grenade chosen. And then uh, it says grenade pool. He's got two. Most of them have two. Frag gives, it does two damage, so it would target everybody in the main square and adjacent squares with two damage. And then it continues to say a hit character in the target square is dealt one additional damage, so they take three. Each other hit character is knocked back from the target square. So they take two and then are knocked back. Then we've got Plasma Grenade, which is one of the fun grenades in Halo. Uh, it does no damage. So um, it lands in the target square, does no damage to adjacents. Mark a hit character in the target square. At the beginning of your next turn, deal two damage to the character marked in this way and one damage to all adjacent characters that are friendly to that character. So they have to basically be stuck there. It gives them a chance to get away before they deal damage to their friendlies. Uh, Master Chief Needler also has a special damage power for his first four clicks. That is Bandolier Piercer. When Master Chief hits a target with a ranged combat attack, if the target possesses the grenade symbol, which Caller will not, deal at one penetrating damage after the attack resolves and the target's force decreases their grenade pool by one. Um, oh, I guess the grenade pool is, it's just like a cumulative thing. So I get a plus two for all those guys and then a plus one for him. So I actually have nine grenades is how that works. I was reading it wrong. Uh, next up is Master Chief and Cortana. Uh, so they again have throw a grenade plus one to my grenade pool. They have the frag grenade, and they also have the flashbang grenade, which also does no damage. The target square for this grenade can be within eight squares, so I can throw it a little bit farther. Place an action token on all hit characters that have zero tokens. That's all it does. It's kind of cool, though. Uh, strategic positioning is his special speed power for his first three clicks, and that is Master Chief and 
Cortana can use Running Shot and Stealth. Um, then he's got a special attack power from clicks 4 through 8, which is the rest of his dial. Uh, that is Battlefield Requisition. For each opposing character that takes damage from Master Chief and Cortana's attack, choose one, add one grenade to my grenade pool, or modify another character's attack value by plus 1, another friendly character's attack value by plus 1 this turn. So, kind of a cool little way to gain grenades back. Then I've got Master... Well, not Master Chief. This is just generic Spartan pl uh, with the plasma rifle. So uh, he's got throw grenade, grenade pool plus two, and then his new grenade that he adds to my cumulative uh, grenade total is Thermite. Does one damage, and then I can destroy up to three squares of blocking terrain or walls adjacent to the target square. So... That's a fun one, especially on, like, uh, indoor maps. You can destroy a lot of stuff with thermite grenades. You still have to target a character to do it, though. Um, then I've got a special attack power for over half of his dial, and that is extra grenades. When using a grenade, if the attack roll is doubles and any opposing character is hit, increase the number of grenades in your grenade pool by two. I'm just going to have a ton of grenades by the end of this game. Uh, probably won't use a whole lot. Mm. Then he's mm. got <laughs> the bottom half of his dial, clicks 4 through 8. He's got stun shot. When Spartan hits a character with a ranged combat attack, after actions resolve, give the target an action token if they have zero action tokens. So he's only doing 2 damage on those clicks, which means uh, the action token will be at least worth it. Uh, won't be doing a ton of damage. Uh, next up, we've got Master Chief Battle Rifle. Um he doesn't add any new grenades to my grenade pool, but he does have a plus two. And he's got a special attack power for his first four clicks, which is soften him up. After using the throw grenade ability and hitting one or more targets, after actions resolve, Master Chief may make a ranged combat attack targeting one of the hit characters as a free action. So, pretty solid. And then, last but not least, is Sergeant Johnson hyphen shotgun. Not hyphen, uh, parentheses, shotgun. I think that's his last name. Johnson shot. There you go. Um, Get it right. His last three clicks, he's got the special on your feet uh, damage power. Sergeant Johnson can use leadership and perplex. When using leadership, Sergeant Johnson treats friendly characters within four squares that share a keyword with him as adjacent. So a little bit of uh, mm. leadership cheating there with my role. Uh, he's also the only character on good. my team that's in Dom, but that no longer does anything. That's just the standard symbol. So... He's the only one that's current dated. I okay, guess. nice. Uh, all right. Well, next up is my Forces of Sauron team. We'll go ahead and we'll start off over here with the uh, one of the nine. Uh, these top three guys all have the Nazgul keyword, which sort of, I don't know, sort of works well. Uh, he's got a trait, which is whenever this character or another friendly character with the Nazgul keyword is KO'd, heal one damage on all friendly characters with the Nazgul keyword. So that's pretty neat. Uh, so the next three guys all have it, so they can all, you know, sort of benefit from that trait. The Servant of Sauron has a special attack power, his whole dial, which has fallen into darkness. Servant of Sauron can use Blades, Claws, Fangs. When he does, on a result of 1 to 2 of the D on the D6 roll, until the end of the turn, any attack that hits made by friendly characters with the Nazgul keyword, including this one, is a critical hit. So if he just oh, fails dang. his Blades, right, every yeah. other attack roll... Made by friendly guys, the Nazgul keyword is a crit hit. It's pretty solid. It's pretty solid. Uh, last for our Nazgul boys is the Black Rider. Uh, he's got Wraiths on Wings for his special speed power. Uh, Black Rider can use Phasing Teleport, Stealth, and the Carry ability. When he uses the Carry ability, he can carry up to two characters if they each share a keyword with him, or up to four characters if they all have the Nazgul keyword. There are still only just two Nazgul keyword dudes, um, so that's all right. Uh, next up, we'll do. We'll jump over here to Shagrat. Um, Shagrat here has Erica High Captain for his last three clicks on the speed. Uh, friendly characters adjacent to Shagrat and making close combat attacks modify their attack values by plus one if not already modified by plus one or more. It's pretty neat. And then he's got a uh, damage power for his first two clicks. When Shagrat hits an opposing character after actions resolve, he may use Force Blast against the same target as a free action, but can't knock back a character more than three squares. It's a powerful blow, but eh, it's not that powerful. So let's calm down here, Mr. Shaggy Rat. And then uh, Olog, Olog High, Olog High here. He's a, he's a big boy. He's peanut base. 
he has a special speed power trample for movement purposes oleg high ignores characters possessing the standard damage symbol once per turn when he moves through a square occupied by an opposing character roll a d6 on the result of four through six deal that character one unavoidable damage Oh. Some 50-50 unavoidable damage going on here. Big fan, big fan. And then we have the Mouth of Sauron. He's got a special speed power, first three clicks. He can use Mind Control. When he does and hits, roll a d6. After actions resolve, on the result of a five through six, deal one damage to the target of his Mind Control. Pretty cool. And then he has Demoralize, Perplex and Probability Control. When he uses Perplex, he can modify combat values only by negative two and he does not need line of fire to the target if the target is within five squares. So pretty That's pretty sweet. Pretty solid, yeah. Right. Uh, and then I know you've been wondering what these little poggy dudes are with the big dice. Uh, we have the eagles uh, to your right there. Uh, they will not be able to use their horde power since I've only got two eagles in the stack. So they're just sort of, you know, some birds. That's just, it. That's all they do. I mean, um, they're standard yeah. flyers, so... Standard size. Standard flyers. flyers, which is solid. Very solid. Uh, and then we have the Mama Kill. These are the elephants. Uh, I do have four in this stack for trample. So when stacked, Mama Kill ignores the effects of hindering terrain and characters on movement. When M, so N equals four, uh, after actions resolve, deal one damage to each opposing character occupying a square that Mama Kill moved through. Pretty sweet. So there's some more uh, moving through beyond some damage, but they're pretty slow. Only I, six speeds. So I do not, not like crazy. that they're standard size because they're pretty big in the movies. They're big, yeah. Pretty they're sure, humongous uh, elephants, way bigger than normal elephants. Yeah, legless like, like surfs down one of their tusks or something. Like, Instead, my eagles can carry them. But the eagles are also pretty big too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but all right, yeah. Those are our teams. We got we got some guns versus some some fantasy boys. Yeah. Um. No, no big fans of the fellowship. It would seem in these first in the first set. We got a lot of Sauron. Uh, I mean, obviously, I was able to make a name theme team out of it, so very crazy. But all right, Simeon, why don't you go ahead start us off since you did win? I know it's a bunch of dudes in black robes. It's so hard to tell who's who. <laughs> yeah, the villains are way more interesting in uh, Lord of the Rings, at least. So, um, no villains on my team. I guess it's. Uh time to storm the castle so it looks like my average speed is eight so we'll just go with that for now um it is a 600 point game and i do have a leadership so i should be able to get the majority of my guys out even though i don't have any way to carry them so let's see where eight squares will get me that three four five six seven and eight I'll position two guys there. We'll put one guy there. One guy there. Uh, we'll go with this guy. The old battle rifle and needler. Uh, no dual wielding on this team. Guess I'm okay with that. It's not not necessary. My fist of rucked. Mm. Go like that, and then for my sixth action, let me make sure he can get there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, he's going to go right into leadership zone. All right, and then all that is left is my one perplex, which is on the spot the plasma rifle spartan he'll perplex up sergeant johnson shotguns defense all right sweet go ahead have my all high dude go one two three four five to here saying he's in that square right there carrying the, uh, what was this dude? Servant of Sauron. Servant of Sauron. To there. Alright, nice. I have my Black Rider carry 
the mouth of Sauron and the one of nine. The one of nine. The one of nine. All right. Uh, actually, no, he won't carry the one of nine. Uh, uh, maybe he will. He'll carry the one of nine. Might as well. Trying to see what is blocking there. Actually, it's really hard to tell. Okay, none of it is blocking besides this little bit right there where it's the the big stairs. So actually all of that is just a ledge. Cool. Hmm. Okay, I'm not a big fan of what we've got going on here. Let's put him there. Mouth of Sauron should probably be there. One of nine. Move him like that. Let's have those eagles carry the mama kill. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. Six, seven to there. And then Shagrat is going to move. Moves eight. Yeah. And we'll say it as your go, Simeon. All right. Severe lack of move and attack on this team, I think. Um, let's see. So first thing we're going to do is roll for leadership with Sergeant Johnson shotgun. Uh, let's see. Running shot and stealth on Master Chief and Cortana. And then we've got charge on Fist of Rucked. And that's all we've got for move and attack. So we've got a four speed, four speed running shots and charges. And I cannot running shot throw a grenade, sadly. So uh, let's roll leadership first. Ah, Sergeant Johnson shotgun is firing blanks for leadership. Um, let's see if I can. One, two. I have to go one, two, three, four. Then I have one, two, three, four range. So I could indeed get somewhere, take a shot on someone. Uh, let's see if it'd be worth it to printed damage. Uh, what you, what you got, uh, Servant of Sauron? What's his, uh, defense power there? He's got invulnerability. Uh, I think all of the Nazgul have invulnerability. Yeah. It's gonna be... Yes, they do. It's gonna be rough with all my two damages. Uh, I guess I don't have that many, but it seems like I've got a bunch let's see i don't know not having to worry about pushing is kind of strange although i do it's feel weird. bad like i will be at a disadvantage once i give my characters two action tokens <laughs> that makes me feel bad um let's not lay it on too thick uh we got enough <laughs> complaints on the podcast let's not uh yeah I have opinions. All right, we're gonna start off with. Uh, yeah, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. If you have opinions, just no one cares about them. Yeah, that's true. Um, you have to admit that to yourself. Move, good old Master Chief, assault rifle, battle rifle, Master Ooh. Chief to here. He's gonna that's, outwit. That's the main guy. Yeah, that's the. That's actually. Yeah, that's the main uh, Master Chief. Yeah, uh, he's gonna outwit Servant of Sauron's invulnerability. And then mm. I'm gonna follow not that a fan up with uh, some Sergeant Johnson shotgun 
uh, first class. Uh, he's going to running shot. This okay. One, two, three, four squares to here. And he'll use energy explosion. I'll have to crit hit for it okay. to do anything to Ologhai, but I might as well try. Yeah. Right, you got it, man. 10 to a 17. Ooh, that's the magic number. I'll go ahead and take my two damage. All right. That's those two. Uh, let's see mm. what else we can follow this up with. So perplex can no longer be used on damage. Um, that means my Spartan Plasma Rifle is just going to stand there and either perplex up a speed or an attack. Um, my two movement attackers that I have left are Master Chief and Cortana and Master Chief Fist of Rucked, both who have eight speed. So I'm guessing Fist of Ruck will need a lot of help to get anywhere. Uh, he's got one, two, three, four... So he could get there and attack an eagle. No, a mumakai. Um, that leaves him in a kind of bad situation. Otherwise, he can go one, two, three, four. And with one perplex, I'm not getting anywhere either. What do we have here? We've got Mouth of Sauron and one of nine. So we're looking at uh, super senses and invulnerability, mm -hmm. and that mouth of Sauron's the minus two perplex guy. So I think we're gonna try for try. that. Oh, he's got uh, exploit, so that's an option too. Um, yeah. Uh, so what we'll do is perplex up the speed uh, using Spartan plasma rifle to perplex up Master Fist of Rucked Chief. Uh, he's going to charge to mm. this square, ignoring terrain as I do, and taking my other action token with me. And he'll swing 10 into the 18 on Mouth of Sauron. Yep. Okay. So I'll need a, a, a big ol' 8. That was just a <coughs> weird flop, so... Oh no. Oh no. My tokens have stuck to my dice. I hate when that happens in normal hero clicks. Oh, there's an eight. I guess we'll doubles. I guess we'll have to prob. We'll have to use a uh, normal mouth of Sauron's prob. Uh, a crit hit, you say? Oh, there's a seven. That will miss. He is not the ruckiest of the fists. Of um, mm. And then my last is Master Chief and Cortana with 4 speed, 11 attack, Psychic Blast. So let's go. Whoa. 1, 2, 3, 4. Go to here. And we will attempt to Psychic Blast. Uh, what do we got? We've got the Servant. And we've got Olaghai. Let's see. Yeah, we'll go ahead and try and take a pot shot off at the Olaghai. Uh, Master Chief and Cortana are saying hi. Okay. To Olakai. <laughs> oh, jeez, that's, that's really so bad. bad. It's really bad. Um, that'll hit an 18. Oh, that'll hit. For three? For three. Then I've got two guys just standing there. Um, so we've got Chilling. My, my Needler. I think I'm going to move him 
he's actually my fastest guy with nine speed. We're gonna move him over here somewhere. Let's count it out. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll go over here. Uh, yeah. Go there with him. And my plasma rifle. Uh, he'll just join these guys. He's got nothing better to do than sit up here. Mm. And that is all of my actions that I can do and all my free actions that really matter. Um, Master Chief and Cortana have an outwit. They could... Uh, what's the Servant of Sauron's attack? That's his blades thing. I'm not super worried about That's his that. blades attack, yeah. Um, we'll outwit Ologhai's speed power. Whatever that was. The... the unavoidable 50-50 charge thing, Majigger. Yeah. Yeah. He wasn't going to get to me anyhow, but... Okay, then. Um, I get to say this unironically for the first time ever, but uh, I'm going to roll for willpower on Shagrat. <laughs> oh, wow. It's a six. I'd there say it's go. a success, boys. Rolling for willpower. Rolling that good, that good six. All right. What a time to be alive. All right, Very cool. Easy. That makes it way easier uh, for what I'm going to have to do here. Um, think, it's, uh, what's the order of operations we're going to do everything in? Ooh, it's right after actions resolve. So I don't really want to do that, but I also want him to be there. So if we, we could knock him back there, I guess. You go one, you go one, two, three, four. So yeah, he'll go like one, two, three, four to here. Uh, before we do that, let's perplex down uh, Master Chief Fist of Ruck's defense by negative two from the mouth of Sauron. And yeah, let's have Shagrat go ahead and charge to there. Try to uh, punch him. We got a, what is it, nine for two here. Big nine for two. I've got a 15... That'll hit. Just barely, Just barely hits. Yeah. So I have toughness. Oh, and then, are you doing? Is it just normal two damage? Yeah, just normal two damage. Okay. And then I can go ahead and use force blast as a free action to knock you back here. Let more people be able to take a swing on you. All right. So you'll just go back the one space. Well, I do have charge. He stopped by the big elements. Oh, never mind then. Sorry. I didn't know. I forgot. Yeah, he has special leap climb charge. All right, cool. So that is Shagrat. He does have his trait. Or not his trait, but what is it? He is... Oh, that's a speed power. Oh, never mind. Didn't even need to do that yet, I guess. He doesn't even have his whole cool plus one thing. Let's have the one of nine try to do some exploity damage on Master Chief here. Um, yeah, it's going to be a nine to the negative two defense, whatever it may now be on the, Still on the master 15. Still needing a six. 15. Mm. Ooh, that hits good. 11. I think my master chief will prop for that. three damage. My, my rucked. Okay. Oh wait, you have to have, no, that's, that's old rules. There's one or zero, right? You can have Old two rules, yeah. Now. Ah, yeah, I assume now it's just like you can just probs and it doesn't give you an action token. Yeah. That's for three exploit, so. That'll three, be for three exploit one, straight two, through. Three. Ooh, now I have willpower I can roll for. Ha ha. Ah, there it is. Been waiting for that. Uh, we'll go ahead and poison you with the mouth of Sauron. Oh. Not much has changed. Now we'll use the uh, Muma kill to go ahead and move through you. One, two, three, four. Moving to here. Giving them an action token to deal you one damage. They just sort of 
Yeah, and we ignore we'll hindering training characters for movement after actions resolve. Real, do you just because it's just one damage, it's not an unavoidable or penetrating, it's just one. Oh, that's right. So, yeah, they just sort of move through you and deal you a damage. Imagine characters that can just move and deal damage and not have to roll for it. I hate characters <laughs> like that. Hope WizKids doesn't make any of those. You mean in the future, uh, all after right. this Lord of the Rings set? Yeah, in the future, after this modern. set is released. Yeah. Yeah, I hope they don't make a set that wouldn't normally be modern, modern, and then also make, like, I don't know, a whole chase theme of figures that could, let's say, deal one penetrating damage or something just for moving. Something, you know, ridiculous like that. Uh, you know, something just dumb. All right, cool. Um, I was really hoping we could kill him this turn, but it does not look like we're going to be really able to do that. Master Chief currently. Yeah, I know. We're trying, bro. We're trying. Okay, we used our negative two perplexed. Uh, the one of nine attacked. Shag Rat here attacked. I guess we should have shaved. Saved Shag Rat. Maybe he could have had some more damage going on. And he lost Leap Climb, so that would have been, that would have been a good idea. But eh, it is what it is. All right. We got Black Rider. We got Mouth of Sauron. Mouth of Sauron could... Uh, whatever this guy. Could mind control him. What's his speed? Six? He can move one, two... Three. Yeah, sure. I guess we'll try to mind control this guy with the Mouth of Sauron. Might as well go for it. So we can also still deal, deal you a damage after it. So That's true, yeah. It's a 10. 10 to your 14. Ooh, that'll hit in spades. All right. Let's have this guy uh, move one, two, three to here. And then let's have him do a close attack against his pal. The Needler. Right. There can only be one. That'll hit a... Ooh, that's a 17. nine. Wowzer. Uh, that'll actually miss... Ah. Wait, no, that's a nine. That'll hit an Well, 18. nine will hit yeah. an 18. Yeah, yeah. So that'll hit yeah. for two. Yeah. Uh, sadly, I have invulnerability, so I will reduce it by two. Ah, uh, yes. Don't get use exploit with it. All right, cool. Um, and then... We're going to roll our one dice, I believe, for that version of the thing, right? He gets to, uh, let's see, yeah, on a five or six, steal the target one damage. All right. Target of the mind control. That was a set down. Let's try to roll that again. Aww. Hey, still a six, though. Getting very lucky, very lucky uh, to deal enough. Master Chief Fist of Fist Rucked. Of Oh, Fist oh we really, really nickel was... and dimed in that turn, it would yeah. seem. Fist of Rucked got wrecked. Is that is that better? One, two, three, four. That, That's four that actions. It was terrible, Simeon. Thank you. Uh, it was four actions. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to go like this. Move this guy here for my fifth action. You know, he might as well just be adjacent to everybody. Try to be in their way as much as possible. And then let's go ahead and move the eagle here. Uh, uh, let's give it a second action token. Did the eagle want to carry somebody? Let's see. Oh, that token fell on this guy. Well, here, we'll give the eagle two tokens. One token. Eagle want to carry anybody? Yeah, sure. Let's say this guy moves here. Let's say the eagle carried the mouth of Sauron here. Okay. There we go. Uh, we'll clear the Black Rider and we'll clear Oleg High. All right. Everybody on my team is double tokened. Uh, I had one willpower. It is gone now. But I do still have a leadership with Sergeant Johnson shotgun. So roll that. A two. It's getting slightly better. Um, let's see what I can do. Really not a whole lot since... So Spartan Plasma Rifle will go ahead and perplex down Olokai's speed. Because he can't really see anyone else. I guess I could perplex up a defense. Because he's only got five speed, so he can go one, two, three, four, five, yeah. Um, we'll perplex up... Sergeant Johnson shotguns defense. Um, 
Then we've got Master Chief and Cortana with Outwit. They'll go ahead and Outwit the Eagle. Just get rid of them there. Um, just get, just, just I, delete yeah. them from the field. They can just, yeah, meow with their uh, their ESD if you want to. Uh, I'll I'll get rid of uh, Olakai's super strength. So yeah, he no longer has that. Oh, oh okay. Uh, don't I gotcha. forget, uh, since he has great size, he gets the willpower roll on a three through six, right? Oh, that's right. I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Does he have colossal? Do you have colossal stamina when you're great size? I thought you only had that when you were um. It's not. Fist. It's not the uh, yeah. colossal stamina. It's just part of the great size trait now, which. Oh, that's have, right. It's just great. Yeah. Know, with giant yeah. and colossal. Because colossal stamina doesn't exist. We're learning with you guys. Yeah. And maybe you're already <laughs> learned. In which case, you're learning with us because we are if a little you're slow sometimes. Watching this, these are very new rules. Uh, Sergeant Johnson shotgun rules. Yes. Leadership Master Chief battle rifle will outwit the blades on Servant of Sauron. It's yeah, that's a good call. Power. That's a good call. And I am going to have to clear everybody. Darn. What a shame. What a shame. Uh, while you're clearing, I guess I might as well roll for Shagrat's willpower. See if we can get a get lucky again. That was a set down. Let's not. Okay, that's a three. All right. You still got his charge. You can still move around. Although that Needler guy needing an 18 to hit, not having my prob or that big negative two perplex is really tough uh, for him. And we definitely don't want the Muma kill to like nuked here by this dude because uh, the Muma kill do some really sick stuff. So we're going to have to probably move them for sure. Um, one of nine has one token. He might just move over there and say hi, hello. Um, Black Rider could also carry him. Yeah, sure. Will the Black Rider carry the one of nine to here? All right, so first action. Let's go ahead. I should probably move. Something like this to here. That way his giant reach can be a little useful, even if he's going to get outwitted to high heaven, you know? Um, let's see. Uh, Master Chief, I'm just going to put him back here, right? I don't think he has leap climb sidestep. No. He was down he here before. Uh, yeah, I imagine. Just, I moved yeah, you just move him and take a token yeah. off. Yeah. Um, let's see. Who's got the highest attack here? Ooh, Master Chief and Cortana rocking that good 11. Mm, where's this other Master either. Chief guy? Uh, also oh, rocking yeah. an 11. Um, okay, let's... I don't need line of fire since you're within five. So we're going to double perplex down Master Chief uh, battle rifles attack value by minus two. Let's have Saru... Sorry, Ramon, Mouth of Sauron poison Sergeant Johnson... No. That's Sergeant Johnson shotgun to you. Mm. Oh geez, there's you, just so much outwit on your my team. Oh my outwit. gosh. <laughs> my goodness, this is very inconvenient for me. Oh uh, gosh, that's that yeah, is inconvenient. Um Well, he does only have one token, so he can do something, as well as so can the servant of Sauron, even without his blades. Uh, Servant of Sauron's adjacent to Sergeant Johnson, so we're just going to go for an attack. Uh, big uh, 9, or 10, actually. Ooh, he's a 10 to a... Is it 16 on Sergeant Johnson there? Yes. Okay, let's see what happens. Hmm. Oof, man. I. They are liking... Tabletop seems like... I'm not even going to say it. Never mind, I'm not even going to say it. They're liking the new rules. Um... Yeah, they're liking the new rules. I'll top. Uh, how much damage? That's three damage. Three, yeah. I'll toss one of my theme team probs at it. I don't think it matters if I specify who. All does right. It now, as long as they can see that person, so it'd be Master Chief. Mm. 
Mm, that will hit a 15, I imagine, misses. That will miss. Uh, so we'll do a normal prob with the Servant of Sauron. 17. And that'll hit a 17. One more than the magic number. Uh, so he's dealing me three. I have toughness right now, so we'll yep. two. One, two. Ah, now I've got my special leadership that works with four right. squares. Oh, and perplex. See, now I wish Mouth of Freaking Sauron, this dude could just make an attack. Uh, what is... I mean, we can still go for the try to deal him a damage. All right, we'll try to mind control you with the Mouth of Sauron. Oh. Goodness gracious. All these action tokens. All right, Mouth of Sauron. Going to try to mind control Sergeant Johnson here. Ooh, that'll hit. Uh, Sergeant Johnson's only got a two damage. Is there anybody next to him he can deal damage to? Ah, Spartan Plasma Rifle. We can punch. Yeah. He's got only toughness. So, yeah, let's have Sergeant Johnson just try to punch old Plasma Rifle Boy here. Nine into a 17. That will hit for one damage. That will do it. Wow. 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 I'll let him take it. Wow. It doesn't change too much, though. So. Okay. Uh, and then let's go ahead and roll that D6. See if we can deal Sergeant Johnson here a damage. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. We're getting lucky. We're getting lucky. We're getting a little too lucky. I'm, a little, I'm almost a little worried. Uh, all right. Uh, we're going to clear Shagrat. Um, oh, wait, yeah, we need to move the Mama Kill. We're going to move the Mama Kill. One, two, three, four, five, six to here. They'll be double tokened. Shagrat was part of a trio, right? And then it was Shagrat, Migrat, I have no and idea. Abendigo. Oh, geez, goodness gracious. See, I knew you were going to say something like that as soon as you said it. Oh, my gosh. We'll clear the one and nine. Uh, we'll clear the Eagles. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. That was slightly funnier than normal Simeon humor, so that I'll was... give it to you there. Uh, Mouth of Sauron did something, Servant of Sauron did... Okay, yeah. So it's your go, Simeon. All right. No more leadership. Oh, I do have leadership, actually. Sergeant Johnson Shotgun uh, has a special Back leadership. Back to it. I will roll it, even though it does nothing. No one to take action tokens off. Uh, that's cocked, but it's a four. Um, truly did not matter. Let's see. So I still have two outwits. Uh, I've got plenty of people I would like to damage. So I've got Servant of Sauron still with invulnerability. Mm. And I've got Mouth of Sauron with super senses. Um, I will use Olog High's got toughness. So uh, let's see how we're going to do this. I will. It makes it easy because I can't actually see Mouth of Sauron. So um, Master Chief and Cortana will outwit Olaghai's toughness. Uh, Master okay. Chief Battle Rifle will outwit Servant of Sauron's invulnerability. And then okay. I think... Let's see... Master Chief and Cortana. Did they have something special that I'm not paying attention to? Uh, running shot stealth is all. Um, yeah, we're just going to throw a bunch of grenades uh, this turn. So, oh, let me double check and make sure I can. Uh, power action. Choose a type of grenade listed. Target square within five squares in line of fire ignoring characters for line of fire purposes uh, it is a ranged combat attack so I can't actually do that never mind uh, I'm targeting all characters uh, so what we'll do well, the blue is, guy can yeah Spartan plasma rifle is going to uh, let's perplex up Spartan plasma rifles attack with sergeant Johnson shotgun and okay. Spartan Plasma Rifle will increase Master Chief. Uh, you perplexed his attack down by two. Let's see. We'll hold off on that perplex for now. So 
Um, Spartan plasma rifles out of 10. He's going to throw a grenade. Let's see which types he's got. He's got plasma and thermite. Great. The best two. Um, <clears throat> when using a grenade, if the attack roll is doubles, I get two more grenades. That is good. Uh, let's... Plasma doesn't do anything. Thermite at least deals one damage. But then it doesn't really do anything afterwards. It'll destroy the wall that's next to you. Uh, all three of those walls are mm. destroyed. Not sure if that helps me. Probably does not. So, yeah, we'll go with Thermite just because I want to try and deal some damage. So, it's a 10 into everyone adjacent to Olokai, which is all the boys over there. Oh boy, everybody. All right, let's see what happens. Uh, that is a 15, which I believe only hits. <sighs> that will miss everybody. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, that's... Well, we tried. Um, we'll reduce my grenade pool by one. Uh, Master Chief is currently at a 9, and Servant of Sauron is a 16. So yeah, let's perplex up. We'll use uh, Spartan Plasma Rifles, perplex to perplex up. Uh, Master Chief Battle Rifles attack, so he'll be a 10, and uh, that Master Chief will attempt to punch the... Uh, the Servant of Sauron? Yes. Alright, sounds good. It's the one who is had a invulnerability that I outwitted, so attempt to do that. Uh, 15 is Oof. also too short. Um, I'm also forgetting action tokens. Let's move the stack over here. Let's see. I don't know if that's worth probbing. Might want to save that for something else. Uh, Sergeant Johnson's got an 8 for 2. That seems pretty bad. Um... We're going to Could take care of those eagles with a with a high enough roll. <laughs> uh, we're gonna attempt to running shot break away with him. Actually, yeah, we'll attempt to running shot break. Oh, okay. away. I will have a target. Oh, that's one die. A uh, three will not do it, so he'll stay there. <sighs> And then Master Chief and Cortana. Uh, I kind of want to break away with them, but I think they're just going to punch Mouth of Sauron. I think he's my my big problem right now. So it'll be mm. an 11 into okay. 18 for three, potentially. Yep. That'll miss by Ooh. one. So I will use my my very last theme team prob and attempt to... That's the token for the attack, not for the theme team prob. So I'm out of <clears> theme <throat> team probs. And I will attempt to hit him. Need a seven. Um, yeah. Hopefully... That's a six. So that's oh, a, baby. One I'm, getting, I'm getting very lucky. It will worry me how lucky I'm getting right now in this game. Uh, my Needler guy. I don't think he's got anything going on over here. Uh, hits a target with a ranged combat attack, and I've got no moving attack. Um, but he is an 11 for three. So I've got my Black Rider or the one of nine. 
Let's see. Uh, both are 17 invulnerability. Black Rider. It's Quake 9. Uh, we'll go ahead and just try to break away with him, I suppose. That seems like the better idea. Ah, okay. Another three. Huh. Oh, Simeon. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, this is not going well. Uh, that is all of my perplexes, outwits, and actions that I can possibly take. So, yeah. A, not a very productive turn for team uh Yeah, that's, that's rough. Uh, all right. I get it, Bungie's the studio. I was like, what the heck is he talking about, Bungie? All right, yeah, now that makes sense. At least when this okay, came out. Okay, cool. Yeah. Now it's like yeah. one three or something. Mass Chief and Cortana. Uh, let's see. Ah, just all this outwit is so killer right now. Let's sure have. Would sure would. Be. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's have Oleg High go ahead, and they have Pen Blast. This Master Chief. I don't know. Let's have Oleg High take a swing on Master Chief and Cortana. It'll be an 11 for 3. Into my 17 in Vuln. Let's see. Um, yeah, we'll just we'll go for it. We won't perplex anything. Is it a 10? So that will hit. For 3 damage? For 3. Okay. So just 1, I guess. They don't instantly lose invul. How uh, inconvenient for me. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Uh, the birds still only do teal damage. Mouth of Sauron. I guess the Mouth of Sauron will poison. Deal one damage to Mr. Sergeant Johnson there. Johnson shotgun. His dive Johnson shotgun, yes, excuse me. Ah, Mash Chief and Cortana shame. also still have an 11 attack, which really sucks. Uh, so I guess we'll double perplex down master chief and cortana's attack value yeah let's see what else can we do um probably just gonna have to the party over here let's have the one of nine go ahead and take a swing on needler i suppose it is a nine for three exploit weakness that will, that will hit. hit an 18. Uh... Yeah, wow. That is wow. exactly what I have for three damage. For three, yeah. I am much less interesting now. Uh, you got that right. Let's have Black Rider go ahead now and take a swing. Yeah, he'll just. I guess he could single target Quake you, can he? Yeah. Let's let's do that. If we can knock you back off the, the ledge, it's cool. That wasn't a roll. That was very bad. Ouch. Oh my gosh. So I'm, wow. I'm taking... Uh, that'll four. crit hit for four. So three. Yeah. One, two, three. Goodness gracious. And then I will get knocked back. I'll get the second token. One, two. Can you be knocked diagonally off of an elevated like that? I imagine so, but I don't know. Uh, mm. And I do not have a reducer. I would so think so. For at least another it's one. It's the path. That will take out Master Chief Needler. Well, that, that went surprisingly well. Uh, wow. Truly a Needler. have loss. Shagrat. One, two, three, five, six, six, right? Shagrat. Nope, seven, eight. All right, so we'll move him there. And we'll have the Eagles uh, punch Sergeant Johnson, I guess. It is a nine to his defense. Uh, Fifteen. That is not a good roll. That'll hit for two. Mm, I will hit. One, one does it. So let's give the Eagles a token. Let's give Shagrat a token. And then we'll get a clear. 
Mama kill. The mouth of Sauron. And then what's his face? Servant of Sauron. And it is your go. All right. Well, let's see what I can what I can still do here. Uh, I don't know if my grenade pool goes down when those people die. I assume that it's just like added to a cumulative pot at the beginning. Uh, so I've still got my plasma rifle. Uh, I still have Master Chief and Cortana. Let's see here. Thermite's probably not really worth it. Um, and his special attack power, Spartan Plasma Rifle's special attack power is just something based off of when using grenades. So also not really worth it. Uh, let's start with um, you perplex down Master Chief and Cortana's defense. Uh, let's outwit... Oh, uh, attack uh, value. Yeah, or, yeah, attack value. Uh, let's uh, outwit... The Mouth of Sauron's Super Senses and Master Chief mm. Battle Rifle mm. attempt to punch. He's got an 11. Not a fan. For three. Very much not a fan. Ah. That'll hit a few. We're getting lucky, boys. We're, getting, uh, we're just getting so lucky. I just don't want to say anything Tabletop as of yet. Simulator has truly turned against me. Uh, okay, now see, way. now I gotta say something. You've seen my rolls these last couple of games. Let's not... This is just payback, is what it is, really. Oh, come on. But I didn't it's want not to like say I've that. always rolled it, really man. well compared to you. Uh, well, I, no, I but like... Have. I this is just for, I think I'm getting good rolls equal. Um, <laughs> like, I'm not gonna lie, I, I have. Uh, yeah, yeah. We come will on. perplex down. And I roll all those crit misses. Mouth oh, so many crit misses. defense. And take a swing with Master Chief and Cortana. Okay. So it's a nine into a right. seventeen. I need an eight. I deserve an eight. Hey, look, um, you got it. You still I'm gonna have pop that out with the mouth of Sauron. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yes, I do. A crit hit, you say? Oh, oh, that's a six. A six. Um, and then I will. Let's see. Action token to Master Chief and Cortana. I think we're just going to attempt to do another thermite grenade. Uh, so we'll outwit Olghai's defense. Oh boy. And. Yep. Perplex up his own attack and uh, throw a thermite grenade. So I'll reduce my pool by one. A 10. Plus a nine. Ooh, a nine. Wow, okay. That'll do it. And what is that? How much does everybody take on a thermite? Uh, so, yeah, that'll deal one to the targeted character and then one to each adjacent. But it's just one damage, so it's not penetrating or anything like that. Which you'd think thermite would be, but uh, no. Um, and then this wall is technically yeah. destroyed. I'll get rid of one of the eagle stacks, taking it down to one eagle left. Okay. Did you outwit Servant of Sauron's invulnerability this turn? I can't remember. No. Uh, no, you had... outwitted this dude's toughness and then that guy's super senses. Toughness That's super right. Super senses, yep. And... His whole special thing is if he rolls doubles when he, which I did not, I rolled, I rolled well but not doubles. Really does not matter. I will mm. not have a chance to use that many grenades. Right. 
that is my whole turn. Nice. Nice. All right, let's see. We're going to double perplex down Master Chief's Battle Rifle's defense for sure. And then we're going to have a Surrent of Sauron. Try to take a swing here. 10 to a... Uh... 15. Uh, can I not alt-tab when I'm holding dice? 10 to a 15. Nice. That's I like those odds. That will hit. Uh, we're going to roll blades. Okay. Definitely got to roll blades. Uh, ah, it is a two. So it will be reduced. Damage. <laughs> yes, nothing that does make happens. every Very hit. Cool. Very cool. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, Silver and Sauron fall in the dark. He plays us fangs when he does. And he'll to one to two until the end of the turn. Any attack that hits made by a friendly character with the Nazgul keyword, including this one. I don't know why they say that. As if maybe if I gave him flurry, I guess, uh, is a critical hit. So now, uh, if any of my attacks hit, they're all critical hits this turn. If they have the Nazgul keyword, um, oh, that actually doesn't help me at all because my one of nine and my Black Knight boy are all the way over there. So uh, I probably should not even oh, hold blades, but uh, here we are. Mouth of Sauron doesn't have No, okay. Mouth of Sauron does not have Despite also being a member of the Black Cloak Club, he is a Forces <laughs> of Sauron and Herald only. Uh, so, yeah. Um, but he still ought to do something, I suppose. He can poison no one. He can try to mind control, though, Master Chief. We'll try to mind control him and uh, make him punch somebody. So 10 to a 15. That will hit. Let's have that Master Chief go ahead and punch uh, Plasma Rifle, just because I don't want him to make a breakaway roll. That will hit. Mm, I should hit Plasma Rifle. For three damage, so he'll take two. Ah, I forgot to roll for willpower at the beginning of my turn. What a fool I am. Completely forgot. Cool. I get two damage. That's a token for Mouth of Sauron here. What's this plasma boy looking at? Ah, very nice. Let's have the mama kill go one, two, three, four, five, six. Moving through plasma rifle, dealing him one damage. All right. Let's see, that was one. That was two. That was three. Uh, one of nine can move Olek High. Ah, uh, once again, I forgot to roll for Olek High's thing, whatever. Uh, the Eagle could do something that only has two damage, so we'll have Shag Rat go to here. He'll charge, going after a Plasma Rifle. All right. Got a 17. Oh, dice just sort of dropped. All right, it is a 9 to 17 for hopefully two damage. That is a 17. Oh, geez, lucky. That hits. I don't think I've rolled... I mean, I did just roll a 6, but I mean, like, I don't think I've missed an attack <laughs> this entire game. Well, I do have super This is insane. This is insane. So oh, maybe, okay. So I, I might miss. I haven't technically. made any of my rolls, but uh, it's a 4, so... Yeah, uh, hits for yikes. This game is so one-sided. 2 damage. On 2. Aha, now I have willpower. So I I'm might still use game. something next All right, time. nice. Although all of his powers are based on range. All right. This is a very bad map for my uh, range-heavy team. Uh, Man, I wonder who chose it. I wonder who won map. Hey, I was looking for a thematic one, not for the best advantage. <laughs> I think power no, player. Here, uh, yeah, here are these eagles tokens. And I can finally say it correctly. Rolling for willpower... And that hits. Nice. Very nice. I will uh, remove an action token. Although typically I used it as a defensive power to get out of uh, losing a game. Perhaps the same effect will happen here. Let's not kid ourselves. Um, realistically, I think the only person I guess I can attempt to hit Shagrat. Uh, the, well, that's bad. Um... That's the only person I can really do anything to. So, yeah, it'll be a 10 into the 16. Uh, good old Spartan uh, rifle bash on Shagrat. Yeah. 
into the oven, Shagrat, he says. Uh, we will uh, prob that with the mouth of Sauron. Sorry to... Uh, you're only making me stronger. Ah, never mind. A 15. That will miss by one. I just want to see if you can actually miss every single attack. I think you actually you did hit one attack early on. That's why the mouth of Sauron's on click three. But besides that, I think it's been a miss uh, across the board, which is just very rough. Which is very rough. And we're gonna have the mama kill move one, two, three. Well, I, I know I four, hit uh, five the big guy because he did have impervious. So he's taking some damage from that him. is also true. You did hit the big guy. Yeah, you hit some. Yeah, we're gonna have the mama kill move through the blue uh Spartan just to deal him one damage there. Alright. He is now a printed fifteen. Darn rats. I was really hoping we could kill him. Um and once again, I forget Shagrat. to roll for willpower. Goodness gracious, golly gosh. Let's have uh, Olikai take a swing. What's it? Master G4 turn on click two. Uh, battle rifle dudes on click one. Yeah, so he'll swing against uh, Master Chief and Cortana, his blue radio shack lady friend. Let's see what we can do here. 11 for three. Hope we get one damage off. That will hit it. Oh my gosh. Ooh. A nine will hit for one on Master Chief and Cortana there. Uh oh. 18 toughness now. Uh oh. All right. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. Let's have uh, Mouth of Sauron double perplex down their defense. And let's have the Eagle take a swing. Nice, very nice eagle. For one? For one. Okay. Oh, one after toughness, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Two damage, so one. Yeah, yeah. All right, that's the eagle. Let's have the Servant of Sauron do an exploit on Master Chief Battle Rifle. Ooh, that will actually miss. So we'll prob that with the mouth of Sauron here. Uh, that'll hit a 17 yeah, for be. three damage. And I think we'll just let it be three damage. Okay. Yeah. A one. Um. So Battle Rifle just goes down one thing. So then let's move Black Rider. One, two, four, five, six, seven. Let's go eight to here, right? He has nine speed. Two to do. Yes, he does. So I'll go eight to there. Phasing teleport. See that dude there. And Math of Sauron has flex on their defense. So they are a 15. So he might as well mind control Master Chief and Cortana. And that will miss. No, wait. A 15. Reflex it down twice, right? Yes, yeah. it's a 15. Yeah, that'll actually hit. All right, cool. So we'll have Master Chief and Cortana punch the whatever uh, plasma rifle guy. There's a 15. Uh, that will hit. Uh, 10 should hit. One. One does it. Nice. Uh, now that they're not adjacent to any opposing characters, they'll just go ahead and move right there. Then I'm going to clear Shagrat, and it's your turn. Did you wish to roll for your mind control? Uh, no, I have toughness, right? So I can't do oh, anything. Okay, it's not. Yeah, it's not penetrating damage. Um, yeah, no, it's see. just one normal damage. So technically, uh, he had this power active when you had him under mind control. For each opposing character that takes damage from Master Chief and Cortana's attack, choose one. 
Add one grenade to your grenade pool, or modify another friendly character's attack value by plus one this turn. So that would have just been a Ooh, all right. generic, like, active thing on your turn. Uh, so you can have a grenade if you want, or a plus one to attack. Yeah, sure. Give me that grenade. Now give me that grenade. <laughs> Let me have that grenade, baby. No way of access. I don't know how to add it to my non-existent. Yeah. Well, you, well, you can fine. add it to your pool. You just don't have anyone that can activate it. Oh, yeah. I now have... Right, right. So now the Lord of the Rings boys are like, what? what is this? They just don't know what to do with it. So it's just sort of there. Can't oh. use it. They're like, ah, oh, neat. Let's see. So I think I'm going to go for that strategy. I'm going to try and give myself a plus one with something uh we've got still thinking Shagrat's probably my best option for attacking um it's not going to turn the tide by any means but it's really the only one i can damage right now with that master chief so um i will perplex uh his own attack up by one and he'll attempt to punch Shagrat. So it's a 9 for 2, or a 10 for 2. That is a 17. All right. Two damage for old Shagrat there. Then I will... Goes to click 3. Requisition a plus 1 attack for Master Chief Battle mm -hmm. Rifle. After I hand out action tokens here. So Master Chief Battle Rifle now has a 12 attack. Uh, I will outwit the Mouth of Sauron's super senses, and I will punch him. I will do it this time. Okay. It will happen. There's no way to get out of this. I only need a 6. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But two sixes would be acceptable as well. Uh, all right. Well, you know me. We're going to prob that. Uh, Calder still hasn't used any of his theme team probs either. <laughs> also that, yeah, which is kind of nutty. Uh, that'll hit a Oh, 16. wow. That's a real shame, Simeon. All right. That's all I have. Uh, let's roll for being a big person. Of course, it's a one. All right, nice, nice. Uh, all right, sweet. Master Chief and Cortana, they're our biggest start right now. Let's go ahead, double perplex down uh, their defense, since they'll be the ones we can make the most attacks on. Let's go ahead and have uh, one of the nine uh, do an exploit weakness on them. Uh oh. Or, or one of the nine here. Ooh, that is going to do uh, hit a 15, it would seem. Yeah, that's what I got. Ash Chief and Cortana with the double reflex down. Good, 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 good. For three One, exploit two, damage. Three. Okay. Chief Cortana. All right, let's have uh, Shagrat use Close Combat Expert. It'll just automatically do one into each. Technically, he could charge with Close Combat Expert right now, but he doesn't need to. So it'll be a 10 for two damage. The passive that is close combat expert. And that one miss. Let's see, I want to kill him this turn. Let's have Black Rider go ahead and Quake. Um, before we do that, let's have Oleg High take a swing on Master Chief Battle Rifle. Before we, maybe he'll go down to toughness. Who knows? Olakai will hit an 18. For yeah. one? Oh, wait. Four, For yeah, three, so damage, one. so one. Okay. I move the tokens off of these guys that are clearing so I can give it to Olakai. All right, Mass Chief Battle Rifle still in vulnerability. I oh, know he should be on click three now. Did he take damage earlier? Yeah. 
I hit you with Servant of Sauron last turn for three, so one, and then I hit you with Oleg High for three, so one. Um, now we'll have Black Rider go ahead and Quake. Mm, that will hit ugh, 15, so probably just Master Chief and Cortana. It's a negative yeah, perplex. 14. Of it. Yeah, hit them for two, no one else. That will take them out. We clear the Servant of Sauron. We clear the Mouth of Sauron. And we clear the birds. All right. And it is your yo. Looks like fantasy has done sci-fi in. At least this time. Uh, Master Chief will do nothing special because he's a 9 for 2 surrounded by people with reducers. So he'll try and punch Mouth of Sauron in the mouth. Uh, True. Yeah, Mouth of Sauron. I will not prob this attack no matter what it is. <laughs> It Unless it is a crit miss. It is a four. Uh, so I will now, I will prob this attack with Mouth of Sauron. I will prob that attack with Mouth of Sauron. Into a crit hit, you say. Ah, still I a will 13. theme team prob that attack with Servant of Sauron. <laughs> Going down to two theme probs. It will not matter. Tabletop Simulator <laughs> does not like Halo clicks whatsoever. Um... <laughs> uh, uh, I will theme team prob that attack with the Black within. Rider. It will take quite a bit for me to hit this. <laughs> this is wild. Hey. Uh, all right, that'll hit. For two. Uh, so let's roll for super senses. See what happens. Old mouth of Sauron. Let's really roll for super senses here. Ah. Ah. Well, I tried. I tried <laughs> Simeon. <laughs> okay. That is all I can do that turn. Right, let's go ahead. Master Chief Battle Rifles on 18. Still flex down his defense. Let's have Servant of Sauron. No, 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 no. Let's roll for willpower on Shagrat. The one. Let's roll. No, nah, it's not going to do any more of that crap. All right. Yep. Still flex down your defense. Servant of Sauron, 10 against the 16. We'll hit for a Blades roll of. Three damage, so the same as my normal. One, two. Now there's truly nothing special about me. Oh, Still have a reducer. Uh, tough. Fifteen defense now. Yeah. I have Shagrat charge, and he can charge using close combat expert because it is passive. So he'll be a ten for one, or for two, excuse me. Yeah, whatever. I don't know how that's going on there. All right, 10 for two here. That is a one and a five. Hits a 15, which should hit. For one after toughness. Oh, it's finally, uh, I want Math of Sauron sort of get the kill here. So I don't want to, I want to hold off on the poison for right now. Let's have uh, Oleg High take a swing. Okay. Now let's poison with Math, let's, let's poison with Math of Sauron. And then we'll move three with the mama kill to do you another one damage. Okay. All right. And then let's have Mouth of Sauron just punch you. Uh, he finally has one damage since he took that damage from the <laughs> whatever earlier grenade or something. Grenade, yeah. So he's a 10 for one. Uh, that'll hit a 15. That is my printed value. I only need a, only need a 13. So that'll deal one damage. Okay. Um, nice, nice. So Master Chief's card, where did I put it here? Uh, it says when he would be damaged, or when he would be KO'd uh, by an attack dealing one damage, activate all grenades left in the pool, <laughs> dealing that number of damage to uh, characters within eight seconds. Uh, so uh, your whole team will take seven damage. <laughs> it wouldn't even kill them all. Uh, that's the worst part. That's the worst, yeah. All right. So uh, all right, guys. Uh, shows a uh, mobility beats out range when on the correct map. Really, it it really did end up being that that carry, and then not having to push because I didn't have any indom. You didn't have any indom. Um, 
made us be able to it did make the games faster i will say that you know what maybe pushing out pushing damage isn't so terrible um and definitely the most casual of sense in this game but we'll we'll save our thoughts for later it's just good to it's yeah it's good to play with these new rules to really figure out having if they're the worst thing ever and not being able to perplex it up to three kind of sucks when your opponent has inborn so we'll see how that is deal rough with... i think the perplex change is huge they they are doing they haven't done uh, damage right. reducers yet so we'll get there when the, they get there but that is true that is true right now this is not all the new rules that we know of so another epic golden age brawl has come to a close you guys can vote for what figures you use on our team on facebook twitter discord and the comment section of this video make sure you like comment subscribe hit that little bell notification so you always get you know a little alert when our videos come up uh, anyway, Simeon is going to be building from Gears of War, another Xbox-only title, uh, and then I will be building from Assassin's Creed, both of them, the Assassin's Creed Brotherhood and Assassin's Creed Revelation. We're just going to smash them all into one set, because that's sort of how they were anyways. So yeah, um, I'd play any of the Templars, and you got to put Ezio on the team, I imagine. Like, if, if Ezio and Marcus Fenix aren't on the teams, I don't, I'd be very confused, you know? Uh, but yeah, Simeon, any figures you want specifically from Gears of War? Yeah, there's that Marcus guy, and then uh, that other guy um, that uh, dies at some point. And then there's the Locust guys. Uh, they've actually... Spoilers both... for Gears of War. <laughs> there's ten whole figures, so there's not a lot to choose from. Um, <laughs> but they both do have both factions have interesting team abilities so make sure you read the team abilities a little bit because those are interesting i'm not going to say they're yeah. great but they're uh, probably the most unique thing about the set absolutely well thank you guys so much for watching and as always happy trails